Okay, this video is sort of redundant, but uh, I want to do it anyway. Um, this will be video three of the GE fridge freezer unit. As you know, I've been having some trouble the past few weeks with the uh, the back of the fridge freezing up. And uh, this is now uh, day four. And there's absolutely no frost in the back wall at all. Usually right over in this corner is where the frost first begins. A big patch probably about the size of the palm of your hand. And uh, so what was the issue? It was a thermostat sensor. For some reason, it fell off the copper pipe, the Freon copper pipe uh, uh, that it was on. It clips on and it registers the heat of the Freon as it's running. And I guess at a certain point, it cuts out and at a certain point, it cuts in, depending on the temperature, and communicates with uh, the motherboard, which is in the back. I showed it in a pre previous video. Uh, uh, it'll place there on the back of the uh, fridge. Well, in the lower section where you can get access to the, the uh, motherboard. So anyway, I'm going to include some uh, a picture or two of what was going on, and you'll be able to uh, peruse these pictures and see for yourself. And you'll notice uh, that I did put the uh, thermostat sensor back on the pipe and reassemble. That's why you see in the previous video where I, I thought I may have had the solution, but I couldn't say for sure until I waited a couple of days to see if the frost returned. The fridge is absolutely working perfectly now. So here are the pictures for you to, uh, to peruse.